I'm on uh, Galena Summit today. But I just wanted to show you uh, kind of what we're looking at here and what this uh, incoming storm will be falling on. So we got about uh, three feet of snow here. See pretty clearly this is the old interface uh, from the end of December. So this is all that storm snow that fell after that. And this is all the snow that we had that was faceting during that long dry spell in December. So just starting to uh, worry less about the weak layer that we buried uh, a few weeks ago and now we're even forming a new weak layer on the surface that this next storm will fall on. So here see the December facets uh, they're gaining a little bit of strength but still pretty weak. Still really loose and sugary. The slab here is still fairly strong but then you get up here and you get up into the weak layer we've been forming uh, over the last, uh, the last uh, two or three week dry spill. You can see this stuff's really loose and cohesionless. So uh, this is what's going on in Galena Summit as we head closer to Ketchum. This slab kind of shrinks, the whole snow depth shrinks, and uh, maybe this stronger slab uh, goes away. And basically what we might have is uh, basically weak sugary facets throughout the whole depth of the snowpack. Uh, so either way, um, not a very good uh, snowpack to be getting uh, this incoming storm falling on. Uh, right now the forecast is for anywhere from you know two to four feet of snow uh, starting uh, tonight and lasting through Friday. So we're expecting the avalanche danger to go up quite a bit and um, just wanted you to see what this storm is going to be falling on.